You know, we had a hundred signs destroyed Friday night alone, and they're averaging about 20 a night. I've never seen anything like it in a campaign before. It's deeply disturbing. And what you know, exactly has been happening? Well, for example, on Meadowlands, Long Street, they went from one end to the other. All of our signs were destroyed, slashed, and cut to pieces. And there wasn't a single Liberal sign knocked down. You know, that makes me wonder who's really behind this. Yeah, it's a, it's a real challenge. You know, the, the pity of this is that a lot of our donors are seniors, the people who can't afford to give a lot of money, but they're giving money to help us out, get some signs up. And these people come and destroy the signs. It's just really disrespectful. But, uh, you know, I'll tell you, we're determined. For every sign they take down, we're going to put two back up. You just can't, uh, you can't win an election with this kind of tactic. You have two police reports that uh, have been put in for today. Yeah, absolutely. We've alerted the police to this, and they're, they're keeping a careful eye. Some people are going to end up getting charged over this, and so they should, I think. So what's the next step? Uh, just increased vigilance from us, and I hope the police catch these guys. But, you know, I'll tell you, it's, it's frustrating because when you see people using tools, people going out day after day, you know, this isn't kids destroying signs. You see some of that in every election. This is people who, I don't know if they're being paid to do it or what their, what their angle is, but they're working hard at it. I'll give them that. Yeah, you, you can see that you know, ordinary people out there are really disturbed by this. They're talking about it on Facebook. They're talking about it on Twitter. You know, people just think it's just not right. You know, disgusting is the word that I see most often mentioned on social media. And I hope you know, people keep a good eye. If you can get a picture of these people taking the signs down, police would love to have it, I'll tell you.